Hi, I'm Bob from Crane Appliance. Since 1983, as a family-owned company, our goal has been simple, to give our neighbors to the Cape and Islands a great shopping experience. Rest easy knowing our professional team will listen to your needs and help you pick out the perfect appliances. We'll take care of everything throughout the sale, delivery, and installation process. And we even have our own in-house service department. Crane Appliance, we call the Cape and Islands home. Hosting services for FCTV.org are provided by Meganet Communications. Meganet offers a wide array of internet services, including Mega Backup Cloud Service, Server Colocation, T1, Fiber, Metro Ethernet, as well as telephone services such as hosted PBX and Digital Voice. Their number one goal is to keep your communications network up and running and allow you to focus on growing your business. 877-634-2638 or meganet.net. Good evening and welcome to the meeting of the Falmouth Select Board. It is Monday, April 8th, 2024. It is exactly 6.30 and I would ask that you join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We'll get right into business. Discuss and vote motions and reports to the April 2024 town meeting as needed. Any issues? Uh, I'm sure. Okay. Discuss. okay. Then we do don't need to vote or do no. anything on. Okay. So discuss and consider uh, vote date for the November 2024 town meeting. And we were looking at November 18th. Currently, we do have a select board meeting scheduled for that night, but we may be moving that around. We looked at the 4th, but uh, the 5th is an election day. So we didn't want to do that. We, the 11th is Veterans Day. So we went to the 18th. Any questions or concerns about that? It's a little late. Does it cause any problems for scheduling things afterwards? No, yes, we don't have any borrowing. Um, following the fall town meeting, so we're okay with that. And we did discuss it at our, at our pre um, meeting. I would entertain a motion. I'll move that. Second. Okay, I have a motion and a second. Any further discussion amongst the board? S hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Passes unanimously. Okay, number three, uh, discuss and vote to petition the state traffic engineer for speed limit changes along Woods Hole Road and Falmouth pursuant to MGL Chapter 90, Section 18, as amended by Chapter 358 of the Acts of 2022, and that is Article 24. So let's just get out ahead of it, right? Yeah, so Madam Chair, um, a couple of years ago, the governor signed this Chapter 358 of the Act of 2022 into law. Um, in an effort to reduce traffic fatalities, made several amendments. Um, section 13 of the acts, and in your packet, um, there's a there's a copy of the uh, nine-page um, language. Page seven of nine uh, highlighted the, the relevant section. Uh, provides that the select board may petition the Department of Transportation, and specifically the State Traffic Engineer's Office, to modify the speed limit on a state highway within their geographic boundaries. The um, petition must be made in writing to the state traffic engineer, and the department has 90 days from the statute to either approve or deny the petition. Um, as I understand it, upon approval of the, of the petition or the expiration of the 90 days, without any action being taken, the petition speed limit changes take effect, and the department is required to install the uh, appropriate new signage. So, uh, Madam Chair, as you indicated, this is a petitioner's article, Article 24 tonight. Um, I had spoken with the petitioners months ago, um, the Smart Task Force group, um, and it explained that um, you know there's a path through the select board where the same thing can be accomplished, petitioning the state traffic engineer through the select board, a letter to the state traffic engineer, um, recommending that the select board approve and uh, direct, appro approve uh, the submission of a petition to the state traffic engineer for speed limit changes along Woods Hole Road in Falmouth, and uh, specifically as reflected in what I marked as Exhibit A, which is a map of uh, Woods Hole Road um, and the, and the uh, relevant sections of Woods Hole Road that we're requesting reductions. And I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. 
Questions from the board, Mr. Mustelli? So it, it's just a letter to the traffic engineer that will constitute a petition. That's my understanding. That's all we need. Mm. And then the article would then be withdrawn tonight. I think they probably still vote it positively in Woodbury, right? It, it may go through on the blanket, but I think we would have to announce That's what Yeah, I'll just do something. Why wouldn't we? Right? Yeah. It's a good thing, right? Yeah. yeah. Can I move that? I don't think it hurts us no, to have two. There's a motion. This is a written motion? Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> I make a motion to approve the submission of the petition to the state uh, state traffic engineer for speed limit changes along Woods Hole Road and found that that's reflected in the map marked as Exhibit A. First went to MGL Chapter 90, Section 18, as amended by Chapter 358 of the Acts of 2022. Second. Okay, I have a motion and a second to approve. Any further discussion amongst the board? Hearing none, all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Passes unanimously. Okay, vote to accept grant award in the amount of $4,545 from the Falmouth Road Race, Inc. to the Falmouth Beach Department to purchase rescue boards, storage bins, megaphones, pool buoys, and parking attendant chairs. Madam Chair and Select Board, back on December 1st of 2023, <coughs> the uh, Assistant Superintendent of Beaches uh, submitted this grant application to the Found Road Race Incorporated. Um, the request was uh, grant funding in the amount of $4,545 for, as Madam Chair indicated, um, rescue boards, storage bins, megaphones for use on windy days at the beach, pole buoys, and parking attendant chairs. Um, 17 days later, on December 18th, the uh, Falmouth Road Race Incorporated notified Beach Department that the request was granted in full for that amount of $4,545. I'm recommending the select board vote to accept the grant award in that amount of $4,545, $4,545 from Road Race Incorporated to the Family Beach Department to purchase the rescue boards, storage bins, megaphones, pole buoys, and parking attendant chairs. Yeah, motion to accept the grant award. I'll second the scrub request the motion. Okay, I have a motion and a second. Any further discussion amongst the board? I would just say thanks again to the road race for always funding things when we need them. Yep. Mm -hmm. Agreed. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Passes unanimously. Thank you. Any other business? Mr. Brown? Should we hold any comments on any of the articles till we're in the middle of the meeting? Is there any reason why we shouldn't discuss them? We just had a point I was going to raise. That's something I noticed. One of the pieces of correspondence from folks from the Green Center who, uh, was mentioning that Wasted Incorporated will take away the urine. But in their letter, they even state that it's not yet really determined where it will go. They're willing to transport it. I'll bet you money that comes up in discussion on the floor. I don't think so. It will. Just curious if others had noticed that little mm -hmm. kind of inference. It wasn't clearly stated, but they did say there's, there's still things to figure out. So I don't know exactly how the, the language was, but it seemed like they were kind of inferring that we're still looking for a place to yeah, take okay. it. And I saw that over the weekend. I think it was. And I'm not sure under whose authority they uh, they entered into some kind of discussions with this wasted. Just private have. research, I guess, to try to say that there's options out there. Even that. It almost sounds like they landed and that, that was the option. Mm -hmm. by name. Right, but it so seems like it's not quite closed loop there. Great. That'll be interesting. Any further comments from the board? Okay, I will entertain a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. Okay, I have a motion. And a second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. Thank you.